From September 23rd to October 16th, Ontario Culture Days programs are coming to a community near you. To dive a little deeper into this, more than just a name, let's chat with Caitlin Patience. She is the Outreach Manager for Ontario Culture Days. And Caitlin, let's start with the basics. What is Ontario Culture Days? Hi, Hi Jason. Jason. Thanks, Thanks for having, having me. me. Uh, yeah, Ontario Culture Days is a not-for-profit service organization. Uh, we have a few different programs, but our most popular one is the Ontario Culture Days Festival, which, as you mentioned, takes place from September 23rd to October 16th this year. So that is three weeks and four weekends of free participatory arts and culture programming right across the province. And what's the goal with Ontario Culture Days and the festival in particular? <laughs> The goal with Ontario Culture Days is to engage the public in arts and culture in a um, in a more participatory um, perspective. So people are more inclined to connect with something or get more out of the experience if they actually get to try their hand at it or get sort of a behind the scenes look. Okay, so there's regional hubs all over Ontario. We're of course here in Halton and conveniently enough, Halton Hills is one of your hubs. So what's being highlighted in Halton Hills? Yeah, uh, so there's actually a lot going on in Halton Hills. It's one of our most popular, um, most concentrated hubs, um, and they've been doing it like this for a number of years. Um, so I'm personally looking forward to a few different things, um, but there are a series of free events, activities, and exhibitions uh, being presented by the cultural services from the town of Halton Hills, alongside uh, various partners and artist facilitators across the region. Um, there's a number online right now, but there's still more to come. I'm looking forward to the visual diaries for fun and wellness, which will be at the Acton Town Hall. And then uh, Halton Hills also has a huge art in the park program. So there's about uh, five different locations, including Glen Williams, the Georgetown Fairgrounds, Dominion Gardens and Prospects Park. So you can go and check out some art in situ. Um, and then we have a lot of um, family friendly activities as well, including the very popular Moccasin Identifier Project, and that's happening at the Halton Hills Public Library. Um, that's also happening uh, in, sorry, Acton and Georgetown. Mm -hmm. And then there's the Children and Youth Art Exhibition also happening at the Public uh, Halton Hills Library. That's great. And where can people go to find out more? Um, so they can visit onculturedays.ca and they can access the Halton Hills Regional Hub page to find out more and to access all of the activities that will be happening in Halton Hills this festival. Um, if you're interested still, uh, there's time to um, host an activity. You can also get in touch with the cultural services in Halton Hills. 